now for part D of question 13 from June 2014 IAL. Rectangle C and D and D and E touch for distance H meters as shown. Um, use your answer to part C or otherwise find the value of H. Now we already found what theta was. Okay, theta, um, before we rounded it was 36.86 to two decimal places. Okay, so that's 36.86. So we know that theta is 36.86. Okay. Now that's going to help us to find what h is, okay? Because what I know is I know that this length, from there to there, that length is four meters, okay? Um, so let me just move it here, make it easier for us to look at. That length there is four meters, okay? And that means the length on this side here. Let me just do it like this. That means the length uh, from here to here, you can see that, that length is going to be 4 minus h. This is 4 minus h. And this length here is 2 meters. And this angle is 36.86. So we've got everything we need now to find what theta is. Okay, that's 2 meters. So we've got basically got a right angle triangle. Let's look something like this. This l this length is four minus h. This is a right angle. Okay. Um, this length here is two meters, and this angle here is thirty six point eight six. So we can use trigonometry. We can say that this is opposite. This is adjacent. So I can say the tangent of the angle. The tangent of thirty six point eight six degrees is equal to the opposite, which is two, over the adjacent, which is four minus h. So if you rearrange that, if you rearrange that, let me just move this over here so we can see what's going on. So if you rearrange that now, we can solve the equation. We can say if these two will swap places, say 4 minus h is equal to 2 over the tangent of 36.86. So if we add h and subtract this from both sides you can say that 4 minus 2 over the tangent of 36.86 is equal to h so then that will be our value of our h so we can say 4 4 minus 2 divided by the tangent of 36.86. That gives us 1.3323. 1 1.332. It says the two significant figures, I think. Yep, two significant figures. That's the third, that's the second. So it's 1.3. So h is equal to 1.3 meters and there's our answer and that's the end of that question thank you for watching